Shenzhou or Chinese Shenzhou Pinyin Shenzhou is a spacecraft developed and operated by China using Soyuz technology to support its manned spaceflight program. The name is variously translated as Divine Vessel, Divine Craft, or Divine Ship. Its design resembles the Russian Soyuz spacecraft, but it is larger in size. The first launch was on November 19, 1999 and the first manned launch was on October 15, 2003. In March 2005, an asteroid was named 8256 Shenzhou in honor of the spacecraft. History China's first efforts at human spaceflight started in 1968 with a projected launch date of 1973. Although China successfully launched an unmanned satellite in 1970, its manned spacecraft program was cancelled in 1980 due to lack of funds. The Chinese manned spacecraft program was relaunched in 1992 with Project 921. The Phase 1 spacecraft followed the general layout of the Russian Soyuz spacecraft, with three modules that could separate for re entry. China signed a deal with Russia in 1995 for the transfer of Soyuz technology, including life support and docking systems. The Phase 1 spacecraft was then modified with the new Russian technology. The general designer of Shenzhou 1 through Shenzhou 5 was Qi Faren, Qi Faren April 26, 1933, and from Shenzhou 6 on, the general design was turned over to Zhang Bainan, Zhang Bainan June 23, 1962. The first unmanned flight of the spacecraft was launched on November 19, 1999, after which Project 921 over 1 was renamed Shenzhou, a name reportedly chosen by Zhang Zemin. A series of three additional unmanned flights ensued. The first manned launch took place on 15 October 2003 with the Shenzhou 5 mission. The spacecraft has since become the mainstay of the Chinese manned space program, being used for both manned and unmanned missions. <laughs> Design Shenzhou consists of three modules, a forward orbital module, Gui Dao Kang a re-entry module Fan Wei Kang in the middle, and an aft service module Tui Jin Kang. This division is based on the principle of minimizing the amount of material to be returned to Earth. Anything placed in the orbital or service modules does not require heat shielding, and this increases the space available in the spacecraft without increasing weight as much as it would if those modules were also able to withstand re-entry. Thus both Soyuz and Shenzhou have more living area with less weight than the Apollo CSM. Complete spacecraft data Total mass, 7,840 kg Length, 9.25 m Diameter, 2.80 m Span, 17.00 m Orbital module The orbital module Gui Dao Kang contains space for experiments, crew serviced or operated equipment, and in-orbit habitation. Without docking systems, Shenzhou 1-6 carried different kinds of payload on the top of their orbital modules for scientific experiments. Up until Shenzhou 8, the orbital module of the Shenzhou was equipped with its own propulsion, solar power, and control systems, allowing autonomous flight. It was possible for Shenzhou to leave an orbital module in orbit for redocking with a later spacecraft, something which the Soyuz cannot do since the only hatch between orbital and re-entry modules is a part of re-entry module, and orbital module is depressurized after separation. In the future it is possible that the orbital modules could also be left behind on the planned Chinese Project 921 HAVE space station as additional station modules. In the unmanned test flights launched to date, the orbital module of each Shenzhou was left functioning on orbit for several days after the re-entry module's return, and the Shenzhou 5 orbital module continued to operate for six months after launch. Orbital module data Design life, 200 days Length, 2.80 meters 9.10 feet Basic diameter, 2.25 meters 7.38 feet Maximum diameter, 2.25 meters, 7.38 feet. Span, 10.40 meters, 34.10 feet. Habitable volume, 8.00 cubic meters. 
Mass, 1,500 kg, 3,300 pounds. RCS course no X thrust, 16 by 5 N. RCS propellants, hydrazine. Electrical system, solar panels, 12.24 square meters. Electric system, 0 0.50 average kW. Electric system, 1.20 kilowatts. Topic: Reentry module. The reentry module, Fan Wei Kang, is located in the middle section of the spacecraft and contains seating for the crew. It is the only portion of Shenzhou which returns to Earth's surface. Its shape is a compromise between maximizing living space while allowing for some aerodynamic control upon re-entry. Re-entry module data Crew size, 3 Design life, 20 days Length, 2.50 meters 8.20 feet Basic diameter, 2.52 meters 8.26 feet Maximum diameter, 2.52 meters 8.26 feet Habitable volume, 6.00 cubic meters Mass, 3,240 kilograms 7,140 pounds Heat shield mass, 450 kilograms 990 pounds Lift to drag ratio, hypersonic, 0.30 RCS course no X thrust, 8 by 150 N RCS propellants, hydrazine Topic. Service module The aft service module Tui Jin Kang contains life support and other equipment required for the functioning of Shenzhou. Two pairs of solar panels, one pair on the service module, the other pair on the orbital module, have a total area of over 40 square meters 430 feet squared, indicating average electrical power over 1.5 kilowatts Soyuz have 1.0 kilowatts. Service module data Design life, 20 days Length, 2.94 meters 9.65 feet Basic diameter, 2.50 meters 8.20 feet Maximum diameter, 2.80 meters 9.10 feet Span, 17.00 meters 55.00 feet Mass, 3,000 kilograms 6,600 pounds RCS course no X thrust, 8 by 150 N RCS fine no X thrust, 16 by 5 N RCS propellants, N204, MMH, unified system with main engine. Main engine, 4 by 2500 N Main engine thrust, 10.000 kN 2248 lbf Main engine propellants, N204, MMH Main engine propellants, 1,000 kg 2,200 pounds. Main engine ISP, 290 seconds. Electrical system, solar panels, 24.48 plus 12.24 square meters, 36.72 square meters total. Electric system, 1.00 average kW. Electric system, 2.40 kilowatts. Topic. Comparison with Soyuz Although the Shenzhou spacecraft follows the same layout as the Russian Soyuz spacecraft, it is substantially larger than Soyuz. There is enough room to carry an inflatable boat in case of a water landing, whereas Soyuz astronauts must jump into the water and swim. The commander sits in the center seat on both spacecraft. However, the co-pilot sits in the left seat on Shenzhou and the right seat on Soyuz. In media The Shenzhou was prominently featured in the film Gravity and was used by the main character, STS-157 mission specialist Dr. Ryan Stone, to safely return home after the destruction of her spacecraft. In Star Trek Discovery, the starship USS Shenzhou is named after this spacecraft. See also